Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Panini Certified Football 12 box random team break number two from jazbeescasebreaks.com 32 spots, everyone gets an NFL team, no vet common ship. Those end up getting donated, folks. We take send that money to various charities that we support. Big thanks to all of these folks for getting into the action. Congrats to the winners right here in score pack 38 and 39. All 32 teams are in. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Uh, 202, four times for the hard way. One, two, three, and four. After four times, there it is, Sean. Down to Jason after four. And then four times for the teams. One, two, three, and four. After four times, we've got the Atlanta Falcons down to the Cowboys. All right, so Sean with the Falcons, Robert with the Washington football team and the Rams, Chris with the Chiefs, Cade with the Giants, Nick with the Niners, Anthony with the Bengals, Eric J with the Dolphins, Karen with the Ravens, Kevin with the Bears, Robert, you got my Raiders and the Cardinals, Michael with the Panthers, Colin with the Seahawks, Josh with the Texans, Paul with the Jaguars, Michael with the Saints, Tyler with the Lions, we've got Evan with the Steelers, Angel with the Chargers, Mark with the Buccaneers, Jason with the Jets, Robert with the Titans, Kanan with the Bills, Robert with the Vikings, Jason with the Broncos, Derek with the Colts. There you go, Derek. You got your Colts. Chris with the Fly Eagles Fly, Jarrell with the Browns, Fuad with the Patriots, Robert with the Packers, and Jason with the Dallas Cowboys. There you go. And Evan got a Steelers too. All right, everyone's getting their teams. All right, so let's alphabetize by team names right here. And we're going to pause the video, allow for a little bit of trading time. And uh, when we come back, We'll have the break itself. Stick around. BRB. All right. Welcome back, folks. There were a, there was a lot of trade chatter, but in the end, no deals were done. It's all good here on Wednesday the 26th. So that list right there remains the same. Thank you. Let's put that right there. And once again, you saw that. We mark that random team too, so we know it's from the same master case. Okay, so you can see on the top camera, I'm going to slide these four boxes just off to the side right there. Another four right here. And another four right over there to make 12. Good luck. All right, so my head has not been, I'll have to be honest with you guys and girls, my head has not been in football mode at all. What, uh, anything crazy happening in these training camps? Football's like two weeks away. According to ESPN top headlines, Cam absolutely doesn't feel like Pat Starter. All right. Giants D takes a hit as McKinney fractures foot. Gase, Adam Gase and uh, Le'Veon Bell at odds over running back scrimmage usage. usage. Trubisky and Nick Foles battling. For, uh, for a starting spot. That's what's on NFL uh, Live right now on the NFL Network. All right, we got CeeDee Lamb. Two-color jersey and autograph. Nice start. 110 out of 149 for the Cowboys. Jason Wainer won that spot.
Didn't Earl Thomas already get released, or he may get released? Yeah, I think he already got released. The new generation relic, Jake from State Farm. Bills, yeah, Kip's saying he's done. I guess can't really can't really join a new team and then strike teammates. <laughs> And that's to 99. We'll sleeve and top load all these. Sorry. Sleeve and top load all those before they go out, of course. There's Andrew Thomas to, uh, to 399. These 2020 cards look pretty cool, too. Jalen Hurts, new generation relic for the Eagles. Dodger games postponed tonight. Doesn't surprise me. It's Jalen Hurts, Eagles. Uh, that goes to Chris Freeze. Alexander Madison, autograph. 80 out of 149. Vikings. Dalvin Cook one out? Apparently. Robert Runkle with that one. This might be the guy. Jordan Love. New generation relic to two ninety nine. That'll be for the Packers. Robert with the Packers as well. He won a few spots. And those uh, score pack breaks, nice. Obviously these will ship, that's an insert. Payne and Manning will ship. That's to 50. Where does Earl Thomas end up? Is he, Does he still have... I mean, he still, he still has to have some... Uh, he's not that old, right? <laughs> he has to have usefulness. For an NFL team, would love to have his kind of fire. Dallas, Anthony Pickett saying... Could be a good landing spot. Bucks maybe. El Gran is saying. I don't know. Couldn't the Ra couldn't my Raiders use some defensive help? Sounds like a Raider. Tyler Rutledge says Las Vegas. Yeah. He fit. He fit the Raiders. Pretty nicely, I think. Like an old school Raider. Jeremy thinking Cleveland? There's Tredavious White. To 299. We got Kane with the Bills. Or Kanan? Not sure. There's AJ Terrell. Frank Clark to 450. And LaVisca Chenault Jr., jersey and autograph. That's a catch. 37 out of 299. Oh, there's DeAndre. Speaking of DeAndre Hopkins, Indiana. They're talking about him on uh, NFL Total Access right now. Kyler Murray making some throws. DeAndre Hopkins apparently getting getting healthy. Can't believe he's on the Cardinals. That goes to Paul and the Jags. C.J. Henderson autograph. Jaguar, another Jaguar to one ninety nine. I I still don't understand. Well, I kind of do, but I'm not sure. Bill O'Brien's on the hot seat, right, for Houston? If that trade doesn't work out, like if their team doesn't look very good, doesn't win a lot of ball games, and DeAndre Hopkins just starts going off, 
Here's Derek Brown to 399. Bill O'Brien's hoping to God that his players make him look good. Here's Cole Komet, new generation relic to 299. Bears, Kevin. It'll be exciting to see what Kyler Murray does in his second year as well. That's to 99. Kyler MVP, Kip saying. Well, from from what I understand, from what little from a, what what little I've seen, it seems like Kyler Murray kind of protects his body better than say a Tua does. So even though, in spite of his size, you know, I th I think he. Uh, I think he could be really good. That's true, yeah. Maybe follow the Mahomes, Lamar Jackson path. Mobile quarterbacks, big arms, and some legs. They got some weapons there for him. DeAndre Hopkins is pretty good. They've got a couple young receivers they've drafted over the years that could be more than serviceable. Fitz is still on that team. Great veteran presence. Yeah, the trend of second-year MVP quarterbacks is pretty good. What if this guy won MVP? Baker Mayfield? What if he just goes off? Now that he has a real coach on his team. There's Lynn Bowden Jr. Alex Highsmith. Oh, thought that was giving me an autograph. Jacob Eason. New generation relic. Derek says, good Joe, what are you talking about? Look at that Browns offense on paper. It looks, it looks really good. For the Blue Horseshoes, uh, that will be for Derek. That's his team. Cleveland just losing culture. Not a player issue, says Kip. Full disclosure, Kip is a Ravens fan. Joe Mixon. Chris Godwin, 203 out of 299. Wow, Odell Beckham Jr. traded before season ends, says Indiana. So it just... Falls apart for Cleveland. It's a shame. Jarrell Taylor, 399. Carry on Johnson to 50. And there's my boy right here, Brian Edwards. Silver and black patch. Nice autograph. 389 out of 449. Looking forward to the Raiders. I'm not looking forward to the Raiders' defense this year, but definitely looking forward to the Raiders' offense this year. That should be fun. And there's uh, Shaquille Barrett. Mirror signatures for the Bucks. And that will be for Mark H. I think maybe a little tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. There's got to be some Brady. Man, maybe I didn't. I haven't seen any yet, but there's got to be some Brady's in here. That should have some some decent secondary market value. Next box. Good luck, everybody. Speaking of the Buccaneers, how, how are we feeling about the Is that everyone all in on the Buccaneers? Are they going to win it all? Everyone thinks they are, right?
Kip, according to the Action Network, and uh, maybe Points Bet as a line originator, as of early May, the Baltimore Ravens win total. It's the it's second to well actually no the Baltimore Ravens and the Chiefs, according to this line, have the best win total at eleven and a half, over or under Ravens eleven and a half. There's Antoine Winfield Jr. Nice thicker card stock right here, forty one out of fifty rookie signature. Buccaneers Mark. Colin Coward has the Ravens going 16-0. and 0. Wow. I mean, okay, that's, I mean, if you're a sports talk radio host, yeah, maybe you got to make that hot take. Ron saying Saints will win the NFC South. There's Jerry Judy. Kip, do you think they'll go 16-0? Broncos, my rivals, Jason. Jeff Gladney to 299. Denzel Mims to 399. Kip says 13 and 3. Take the over on the 11 and a half. And his goal team, Shaquille Barrett to 50. I feel like this is a special, right? I don't see this majestic car too often. Maybe, maybe repeat fourteen and two. Out of twenty-five, there's Dalton Keene. And for the blue horseshoes, Michael Pittman Jr., new generation relic for Derek and his Colts. Well, no one's objecting to you, Kip, in the chat. So, yeah, I can see that though. Eleven and a half. Maybe I maybe I take the over on that. I mean, maybe other teams may have more value in that. But if forced to pick, got Chase Claypool to one ninety nine. Are we getting extra parallels here? I think we are. Usually it's just one. Keyshawn Vaughn to three ninety nine. Jordan Love, jersey and autograph, two-color patch and auto. 32 out of 149. Packers, Robert, with the Go Pack Go. Indiana is one, uh, saying Dak or Josh Allen for fantasy. Elliot says Allen. I feel like Josh Allen has a weird, weirdly interesting ceiling. But he has a he has a low floor too. You know, because not the most accurate unless he fixed that in the offseason, not the most accurate of quarterbacks. There may be more more throws to uh, maybe more throws to. Stephon Diggs, maybe forcing some balls for Stephon Diggs, maybe some INTs there. But you do get those rushing yards. Anthony says Dak Prescott. Too many weapons for Dak Prescott. See, there's a lot of there are a lot of weapons for Dak Prescott. could be a really interesting team. Got Stephon Diggs. Got some other pass catchers. Got a bit of a running game going. Got a good defense already. There's Derrick Henry to 299 Titans, Robert. And if Josh Allen evolves as a quarterback, takes it to the next level, even just a couple steps forward.
There's to 75, Kyle Duggar. Clyde Edwards Hilaire to 399. Yeah, Buffalo dangerous, right? Bills, their win total is at 9. Over or under? 57 out of 99, Green Bay Packers. A.J. Dillon for Robert in the pack. There's a Brady Stars insert right here. It doesn't look too bad in a Buccaneers uniform. And Alan Lazard. Mirror signatures autograph for Robert and the Packers. Kip says, I think the game's still a little too fast for Josh Allen. Once he calms down, watch out. Uh, that is 57 out of, 51 out of 75, by the way. Chris Godwin, yeah, that, that, that's why I, I'm, I'm definitely intrigued by the, by the upside of Josh Allen fantasy-wise. I gotta really get into the get into football mode. Kind of snuck up on me. There's Daryl Mooney or Darnell Mooney to 199. There's Mahomes right here. He'll be fine. All right, redemption. Freshman Fabric Mirror Signatures Red. Whatever that's number two. Probably 99, 199, lower. C. H. Chase Young. Chase Young. That'll go to the Washington football team. Robert with the Redskins. And a free top loader. Kip remembers the days when the rule was never draft QB in the first two rounds. Right, and not only that, Kip, there was also, you never start them in their first year. <laughs> never draft them in the first two rounds. They never get a start for a year, for a year, two years sometimes. Now you're drafting them in the top five or one overall, and they're starting almost right away. I know, it is crazy how much it's changed. <laughs> you know, it wasn't too long ago when there were like, in basketball, centers should never shoot three-pointers. That's crazy. What is a guy, what is a guy playing center shooting threes? That's ridiculous. Don't do that. Even baseball has seen some like positionless baseball. A lot of players playing multiple positions. Before it was just like, yeah, that guy's stuck in left field and that's it. Now you guys got you guys have players moving around all over the place. T Higgins, nice patch, nice auto. Forty nine out of ninety nine, teeing it up for Anthony Pickett and the Bengals. There you go, Anthony. Maybe we can find the guy that throws him the ball. It's good one though, nice. There's Andre Johnson, fabric of the games, 54 out of 99. You know, you got me thinking on that now, Kip. Kyler, Kyler Murray MVP? What are Kyler Murray MVP odds right now? Anyone have that on hand? Texans, Josh Zetz. Is there going to be some value there? There's Chris Godwin, number to 450. I'm not very good at futures bet, so that's why I don't really really think about those but, but that in, that intrigues me their certified potential 13 out of 50 Jelani Tavai he's got a 
cool auto. That goes to the Lions. That'll go to Tyler Rutledge. There you go, Tyler, on the board. I don't know. Yeah, what other second-year QBs? Who are the QBs from last year? That's going to be into their second year. Is that just Kyler? It's got to be someone else, right? Tredavious White, 75. Kirk Cousins. You like that? To 189. Oh, Drew Locke. Yeah, that's right, Ron. Josh Yuchi. Ooh, what about Drew Locke? He's got a lot of weapons, too. Jones says 20 to 1 odds for Kyler. So plus 200 on Kyler. What about Locke? Do you have that? Do they give Locke odds, too? Haskins is another second year. I don't know. I don't think Haskins is going to be as good as Locke or Kyler, right? At least not immediately, not this season. All right, next box. Kip doesn't buy a Haskins, but at, at plus 200, he likes 50 bucks on Kyler Murray to win the MVP. Derek says, I put money on Jordan Taylor winning Rookie of the Year, so if you can snag an RP out of here for him, that'd be great. Um, Ted, Ted Jaspi, you see him on the Instagram live stream a couple nights a week. Uh, Ted Jaspi thinks Clyde Edwards Hilaire, that's his Rookie of the Year, Offensive Rookie of the Year selection. Getting towards the end here. Aaron Jones, relic, to 299. Packers, that'll be for Robert. CD Lamb, 399. There's Kyler Murray. We're just talking about him. There's Tom Brady to 199. That'll be for Mark. Yeah, Burrow's got to go offensive rookie of the year, right? That makes sense. Nice Michael Pittman Jr. Two color patch and autograph 310 out of 349 for Derek and the Colts. Kip, I like where your head's at. Since we were, since we were, we're, we were featured in the LA Times, do we get a Funko Pop doll of us? Wow, maybe limited print run. They're not gonna make a lot of us, right? <laughs> out of 35, 22 out of thirty-five lasting impressions. Maybe make fifty each. Boss man, Nick Jaspi, Joe Jaspi, some Jason Jaspi. Well, those are those are the OG guys at Jaspi's. There's a Giants, Cade. Josh Allen to 450. Man, if, if we ever had a Funko Pop doll made of us, I would just hang them up. I would just hang it up. I'd be like, that's it. My life is complete. There's Jerry, Judy, just a relic. 299. See, Drew Locke's got some weapons this year. I would retire on the spot. Tony would buy buy one. They might be limited, Tony. They're not, they're not going to make like a thousand of us. It might not be worth it to make a thousand of us. A hundred? Maybe. There's Tua for the Dolphins. There's David Johnson. Oh, maybe a storefront Funko, Edgar is saying? It's like they do a character in a car or something like that. That'd be kind of cool. 
Although our storefront isn't really, it's nice, but it's not like it's like a, it's like a historic piece of architecture or anything like that. We just have a really nice sign, some big clean windows, you know, some nice greenery out front, but it's not like it's a unique architecture. I don't know if it'd just be a square, I think. You have all the Sanford and Son ones? Do they make ones for Sanford and Son? Well, they make... I feel like we've got... We, 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 we should pitch that to... How do you do that? We got we'll, we'll, we'll get a... We'll get our all-star PR team on it. Yeah, well, how do they... Did, is it one of the things where, where we have to pay them to make it? Maybe it's secretly that? It has to be, right? Funko team isn't sitting there going, you know what? Sanford and Son. I mean, classic show, but come on. Rule one, just make one of every, just, just make everything. Someone will get it. Fair enough. All right, we're going to have to look into that. Wow, nice Jake from State Farm. Great jersey out of 249. That's what's great about certified. You get high numbers, but a lot of color in those high numbers. Buffalo! Buffalo Gold. Kanan. Kanan Matisse. Gets Jake from State Farm. Philip Lindsay. 299. That'll be for the Broncos. Oppo Joe Mojo. Broncos Jason. With that one. Tony, uh, yeah, my Funko would have an action pose, like me doing a train whistle. Yeah, we gotta get that on a shirt someday, too. Yeah, our swag game is not strong, folks. We gotta, maybe, maybe next year, we'll, uh, we'll get our swag game going. There's Chase Young, relic for the Washington football team, Robert Runkle. There's Tom Brady base card right there, and Justin Jackson for the Bolts. 102 out of 149 certified potential for Angel Acevedo and the Chargers. There you go. Tom Brady news in the background. Bringing enthusiasm and competitiveness to Buccaneers training camp. There's Gronk there. I forgot that Gronk went there. Out of 75, Tua in that 2020 street art design there. Remember how it used to just be graffiti, ladies and gentlemen? Now it's elevated to street art. It's a thing now. Which is great, I think. We got, uh, not an auto, but there's Jeremy Chin right there to 399. All right, almost there, folks. Four boxes to go. Luck. Evan needs a Steeler. Four boxes to go. I'll try to find some Steelers for you. Buccaneers win total is 10. Speaking of the Buccaneers on NFL Total Access Live. Buccaneers win total 10. Over or under? Who, do, who does everyone have? Buccaneers 10. I... It, Kip says they're going to land right at 10. That's kind of a tough division, isn't it? i got to get my head back into football mode, folks. This, this, all this discussion is helping me out. Thank you. So they got Falcons. 
in their Saints, Falcons, and Panthers in their division. Panthers definitely rebuild, right? Yeah. Falcons aren't going to go 7-9 again this season. They got to be a little bit better. Buccaneers are 7-9. They'll be better. Saints 13-3. Well, I don't know if they're going to hit 13 again, but they're pretty, still pretty good. Yeah, maybe maybe ten games, maybe nine and seven. Derek D thinks maybe ten games sounds about right. Yeah, man, I mean they might have got that number spot on. There's Russell Wilson to four fifty. Clavon Chasen to three ninety nine. There it is. There's a Steeler. New generation relic. 90, uh, 89 out of 299. Anthony McFarlane Jr. But that's true, Kip. With, with Tom Brady, all things are possible. There'll be that one magic game. They're, they're, maybe they're a nine-win team, but then Tom Brady will just Tom Brady it and just win them a game outright. There's Cole Komet, new generation relic. I mean, they went, Buccaneers went seven wins with Jameis Winston throwing 30 touchdowns and 30 interceptions. So you got to think, Tom Brady's not going to throw 30 interceptions. He might not throw 30 touchdowns, but he's not throwing 30 interceptions. This goes to the Bears, Kevin. And keeps, keeps the Buccaneers in games. Maybe they win some, it'll be interesting. There's Van Jefferson to 199. There's Marquise Brown. Gabriel Davis. Nice patch. Nice auto. 249. Buffalo. You know what I would love, Kip? I would, I would love for Mariota to be... Uh, I, w I would love for Derek Carr to be so good... And Mariota to look good in trick plays. That the Raiders can trade Mariota for some picks. That'd be pretty awesome. Carr will be benched. I don't know. It is a big year for Carr. This is a nice one. Here's a big card. One out of three. Damon Arnett for my Raiders. Nice. That's a catch. That's a nice catch right there. There you go. Uh, who's got my Raiders? Robert Runkle, Last Pop Mojo. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Damon Arnett. Yeah, it is, for my Raiders, it is a big year for, uh, for Derek Carr, I think. I've said this before, I'll say it again. He's got some consistent coaching now. They've got, he's got a running game now. He's got consistent offensive coordinators he's got weapons added to that team you know so so yeah so there's there's a uh, you know, defense might be marginally better be good. Won't matter. Gruden likes Mariota. I think he does. He does like Mariota. Well, that's what I'm saying. I Like, Derek Carr, I think this is, like, a big a big year for him. Like, this is definitely a sort of put-up-or-shut-up kind of year. But, I mean, there are... But there is... I don't know. There are a couple things that are frustrating about Derek Carr. Like... The decision making, I think, is still a bit of an issue, which shouldn't be for someone who's been in the year league for like five or six seasons, right? Sometimes, sometimes he's too aggressive when he shouldn't be, not aggressive enough when he should be. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll I'll message you, Joe P, when that breaks, when your break is ready to go. Three color patch and autograph. Nice. Out of 249. Lynn Bowden Jr. 
Um, once again, Robert Runkle has my Raiders. I'm excited about this guy. That guy might even get some snaps. Maybe some Wildcat scenarios. He is a Wildcat. So 30 out of 50, new generation relic. DeAndre Swift, Lions, Tyler Rutledge. Indiana saying Carl will be a great QB for the Steelers next year. Joe P is a subscriber to Jaspi's VIP service. Thanks for the money in advance, Joe P. There's Saquon Barkley. Autograph. Nice. Out of 20. Nice low number on that one. 8 out of 20 for the Giants. Cade Burson with that. He won that spot. Out of 15, John Hightower the fourth. And we've got Josh Kelly. New generation relic for the Bolts. That will be for Angel. Raekwon Davis to 299. That's 99, Brandon Nayak. Two more boxes to go. I don't know, Mariota really, Kip? He got beat out by Ryan Tannehill last year. Is Gruden just going to quarterback whisper Mariota? I mean... I wouldn't mind. I just want the Raiders to put out the best team available. I care about the, the name on the front of the jersey. Not on the back of the jersey. Oh, I see. You've got Kip has a bunch of Mariota stuff marinating. He needs Marcus to to, to take the starting job away from Derek Carr. Second to last box, ladies and gentlemen. Good luck. What do we got here? We have for the Titans. New generation relic. Darrington Evans. Robert Runkle. Buffalo. AJ Epinesa. For $3.99. Nick Bosa to 199. And Gabriel Davis. Buffalo! Three color jersey and autograph to 349. 332 out of 349. Well, what's happening? Oh, Liz is here. Liz is here. If you got a tracking order from us today, a tracking number from us today. And it's being picked up right now. Justin Tucker autograph. Mirror signatures, 23 out of 35. Man, Justin Tucker on your fantasy team, just set it and forget it. Ravens, Karen with the Purple Birds. And Darius Leonard to 450. And Grant Del Pitt to 299. Michael Pittman Jr. for the Blue Horseshoe. New Generation Relic to 199. Derek D. Tua 2020. 
Melvin Gordon to 25. Dolphins, Eric J will get all those Tua cards. And the final box, good luck. Kip saying, I heard, I hear the Bucks in Madden 21 is really legit. That's a that's a pretty good team. I'm looking at look look at their depth chart right here. I mean, you got Tom Brady, obviously. Maybe their running game. Do they they have LaShawn McCoy? Right there, Ronald Jones a second, LaShawn McCoy, Keyshawn Vaughn are your running backs. They got Mike Evans and Chris Godwin. Not too bad. They got Gronk, OJ Howard, Cameron Brake. They've got a. Uh, they've got some pass catching tight ends there. I don't know how their offensive line is, but if they're halfway decent, that's kind of a, that's a scary team right there. Scotty Miller's a sleeper. Kip saying like a new, like like Brady's new Edelman. All right, we got Cam Akers, new generation relic for the Rams. Robert. Jason Huntley, two ninety-nine. Jimmy G to one ninety-nine. Justin Herbert. That looked like a different parallel, didn't it? But maybe not. The coloring was a little different in the background there, but oh well, and that goes to the Chargers. And there is three color jersey and autograph Chase Claypool. There you go. Evan with the Steelers on the board with an autograph this time. There you go, there's the Steeler. There is, sorry, Martin Hanks, mirror signature is the 35. That's why I have this, this rubber padding right here in case I have Raiders Amari Cooper hands. That's for Nick Stover and the Niners. Cole Komet to three ninety nine and Purple Birds J K Dobbins just kidding Dobbins hey Joe who's this two fourteen out of two ninety nine <laughs> whoa who is that <laughs> I, I, I try to guess <laughs> tell him who, who is this guys anyone have, have any guesses who this is you can you got a white jersey in there. Baseball, because it's majestic, right? <laughs> it's Aver. <laughs> Any guesses? They're ashamed. Not Luis Robert. <laughs> They're ashamed. Just printing too many of them, I guess. That's for Karen and the Ravens. It was Abraham Toro. Nobs, obviously. And out of 75, Drew Brees and... Potential MVP next year, Kyler Murray. And there you go. That was the final box, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much, everyone, for getting into the action. Let's do a quick little recap here. Re -re -re recap. Nice Saquon. Some nice colors here. There's my guy right there, Lynn Bowden. Some Tom Brady's. I was in one out of three. Damon Arnett for my Raiders. The Raiders had a nice little break. Here's the first. There's some numbered Tom Brady here. Joe Burrow. Chase Young. I flip these right side up. 
<laughs> There's Brian Edwards. Raiders. All right, quick little recap if you want to see exactly what these were. Obviously, you can scroll back into the videos there. There you have it. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. That was Certified Random Team 2. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.